Joining us now is Dr. Theo Heller. He is the chief of the Translational Hepatology Unit at the National Institutes of Health. Thank you so much for joining us. Good morning. Good morning. Your session is on uh, cirrhosis and complications. Tell us a little bit of, about what that'll be about. I think it's a wonderful session. It's a fantastic time to be in liver disease. We cover a lot of things from old clinical questions. Does portal vein thrombosis make liver disease worse? Mm. Through to acute kin kidney injury, an emerging concept of acute on chronic liver failure, rare diseases like hemorrhagic, hemorrhagic telangiectasia, and very exciting, cutting edge, looking at the microbiome, the universe within us in cirrhosis and its implications. What's the main objective, I guess, of this session, or objectives? I think that the most important thing we can give to the attendees of the conference is a sense of where clinical research in liver disease is, with in, particularly in terms of patients with end-stage liver disease. If we can translate how we're making a difference and where we're making a difference in diseases like portal vein thrombosis, acute and chronic liver disease, kidney injury, encephalopathy, and that we're opening up doors to the future, that would be great. What is the new information that came out of the Global Burden of Disease Studies? I think it's a tremendously important study. First of all, it reflects the true impact of liver disease. We always talk about how important liver disease is and what an important issue it is globally. But to say that 1.7 million people will die prematurely every year wow. is a tremendous impact. And two thirds of those will be due to viral hepatitis. One cannot but stop and think that that matters. More than that, if you take it down to the individual level, if you talk about a 42-year-old who's got two small children, is just reaching his or her economic peak, and now those children are going to grow up parentless, it's a tremendous impact on a personal level as well as a global level. And that's why what we're doing matters. And you're passionate about it, yes. clearly. Yes, we want to make a difference. What are the takeaway uh, lessons you hope folks who are attending your session will be able to learn? And I think it's a magical time in liver disease. We've struggled for so long with so many things. We're at the cutting edge. We can now treat hepatitis C. We can now control hepatitis B. We're on the edge of a, an era of wonderful therapeutics. However, there's still tremendous challenges. There are challenges in terms of people with end-stage disease now, people in the third world, in the developing world. And so it's a tremendous time for people to get involved and to try to make a difference. It's a tremendous time for people, young investigators, for researchers who are thinking about a field to go into. Even although we have successes, there's still enough challenges that for your whole lifetime there'll be work to do. Maybe you'll be able to recruit some new folks. We hope. It would be great. Yes. <laughs> Terrific. Thank you so much for joining us. You're welcome.